What's going on guys? So today we are looking at the most affordable electric treadmill that you can get off of amazon.com. And I do actually like it. I am five foot seven weighing in at about 163 pounds and this works perfectly fine for me. And I will leave the link to where you can get this or check it out in the description box down below. So click that link and check it out. So let's go ahead and talk about it guys. So this is kind of like a smaller size treadmill, but it does everything that I need. So I'm just trying to run like about half mile to a mile a day and to trim down on my uh, weight a little bit to get that uh, fat off of me. So sometimes I skip a day or two days or sometimes skip even an entire week. But, you know, I would uh, do my best to uh, get on here and run about half a mile to a mile a day whenever I have the opportunity or a chance to do so. So Let's take a quick look at it, guys. Right here, this is about uh, 14 inches in width, and uh, the length is, uh, I believe, over 60-something uh, inches or so. But anyway, keep in mind, again, I am five foot seven, and I weigh at about 163 pounds. And I found no issue whatsoever using this little electric treadmill right here. So it is foldable, so you can pretty much just raise this port up right here. And uh, well, first, of course, you have to remove this little screw right here. Let me go ahead and show you. So just go ahead and remove this screw. If you want to move it around, you can move it around pretty easily. And there's another screw on top. You typically don't leave this on here. I just leave it there. That way I don't lose it. But how you move this around is if you look closely at the bottom right here, you have this little wheels, one on this side and another on the other side. So what you do is just pretty much raise this up just like that. And you remember that screw that I just took out right here? So you would screw it back right here and then in this little hole right here. And then now you can just kind of pick it up and then, you know, roll it or carry it with you wherever you want to move this thing around. So it's pretty light. This entire thing weighed in at about 60 pounds, but really it doesn't feel as if it's 60 pounds. It feels lighter than that to me personally. I can carry this entire thing myself, even without the wheels. I can just pick it up and carry it in the room if I want to. So here is the uh, power cable connected to this end right here. And on this, this is where you will find the main power switch. Off and on. So when you turn on, you hear that little beep sound letting you know it is on. So on the main interface right here, so first things first, you have the key, which will turn this off automatically whenever you need to in case of emergency. If you pull this out, it will shut off this treadmill immediately. So on top here, you have a uh, LCD display. It will let you know if it's off or whatever you are using it at for. So two cup holders or phone holder, AirPod holder, remote control holder, because as you can see, I have my TV right there. So when I'm jogging and running on this treadmill, I'm kind of like watching my favorite show. And I do recommend you doing something like that because it keeps your mind off of looking at this screen right here. And I tend to just leave my phone right here. That way it covered this entire screen. So I don't know how much I've ran because when I look at the screen and I notice that, oh, I've ran only 0.2 mile or 0.4 miles. I know, okay, I only have about 0.1 mile left to run. And it kind of, the uh, you know, trick the mind and like it gets you tired the closer you are to your half mile point or wherever one mile point, then you kind of feel tired just because you know that you are getting closer to your goal. So when I'm watching TV or uh, not looking at this screen and watching my favorite show or listening to music, sometimes I run even a mile and a half or two mile but then I'm feeling as if I just ran one mile because it tricks my mind not knowing how much I've ran. So I just kind of like run until I'm tired sometime. And then uh, next thing I know, I ran like for a mile and a half or two miles. So right here, you have speed control. So this is three mile per hour, four mile per hour, five, six, seven. It goes up to 7.5 mile per hour. And the slowest is 0 0.05 mile per hour, which is half a mile uh Per hour and this is the start button click this and they give you a countdown three two one and it starts so on the display it tells you your current speed right now is uh, 0.5 so if you use this press this mode button you can tell so the time you've been running for 10 seconds th this is how much calorie you burn you can see the light up there and this is the speed that you're going half mile per hour and over here 
the distance is always shown on this side right here. So you can uh, increase the speed slowly, 0 0.6, 0 0.7, 0 0.8, 0 0.9, just like that. Or you can use this quick preset, three mile, four, five, six, seven mile per hour, or go up to the max, 7.5 miles per hour. So here's a quick look at it. And it's not that loud either, guys. So if you're running in the uh, morning, early in the morning, it's not that loud. So you will not wake up your kids or your wife at all using this treadmill. So when you are done, you can press stop and it'll give you the, the little countdown of the speed going down and then eventually stop. But let's say in case of emergency, let's go ahead and press this up to, uh, let's start it at uh, maximum speed, okay? So let's hit it at 7.5 miles per hour. And if something, you know, in case you're so, so tired after running, all you have to do is pull this key right here and immediately, guys, it stops so much faster than if you were to uh, use the stop button right here. So that's always good to have that feature right there. Now on both handles, if you look closely, you have this little two metal pieces on both sides. This is your heart rate monitor. So if you can just hold your hand right there, it measure your heart rate, how fast your heart is beating, which is really, really cool. That way you can kind of keep your heart rate in a uh, good window. And on this side, you have the start and stop button for quick uh, control of using your finger or your hand. Now on this side, you have the speed control. So go up faster or slow down. And that is pretty much it, guys. Everything. Oh, by the way, when it is delivered into you, you do have a, to... Uh, put them together, but it's so, so easy, guys. It uh, comes into you with this part, the main part on top, and the two sticks right there. So you really have to just put in like uh, several screws right here and several screws on top. And that's pretty much it, guys, and you are ready to go. So that's just really, really, really good treadmill for a very, very affordable price. And I like it, guys. Again, guys, one key thing you need to uh, know is I am five foot seven, weighing at 163 pounds, and I run comfortably on here even at the fastest speed at 5.7 miles per hour. It still works perfectly fine for me. And if you're somewhere around the same uh, uh, weight ballpark and the height as me, five foot seven, weighing at 163 pounds, then this would work perfectly fine for you. Uh, I see no need to purchasing any more expensive or bigger treadmill because those other bigger ones, the main thing is I don't like it because it's so big and so bulky. I can't fit it in. I mean, I can't fit it here, but then it takes up like a lot of space and looks so ugly and bulky in the house. So this right here, I just kind of sit it right here. It doesn't really interfere much with anything else that I do, you know? Perfectly fine, doesn't take up too much space. I can enjoy my TV and still have the treadmill. And whenever I want to move it, guys, those more expensive and bulky one, you it will require like two, three, four people to carry them. And it's just, you know, too much for me. So this, if I want to move this around, I fold it and I pull it by myself. Or if I want to, I just pick it up by myself and put it in another room. So... With all that being said, guys, I do actually really like this. It's a very affordable treadmill. It works. It gets the job done. Check it out, guys. Link will be in the description. Click the link. And thanks, everybody, for watching. If this video is good, you like it, subscribe to the channel. Thanks, everybody, for watching. And I will see you all in the next video.